Welcome to Angela's Fashion Fever, the fun game by Gamehouse Studios, where Angela, who is related to the delicious Emily games, she's Emily's sister, but Angela is attempting to become a fashion designer. She's currently working in a boutique, but has dreams of becoming a fashion designer. So this is chapter one, currently in New York, and this is the seventh episode, I believe. Scenario number 11, because these little gold stars were bonus challenges that I did on the end of certain episodes. So off we go with scenario number 11. Pulling an all-nighter has its downside. Make sure Angela stays awake during her shift. Okay. And the winner is... Angela? Oh, the contest, I completely forgot. The deadline, did you? I did it! I came up with something I really loved. I'm so happy for you, Angela. Just imagine if you could win, your whole life could change. Angela? Zzz. Just try and stay awake during your shift, okay? Okay, I've got a little bit of money from the completion of the previous scenarios, but not enough to buy anything useful. So I will not bother. Apparently I've now got some new products. So first thing I need to do is stock up on everything while I've got the opportunity. Right. Then get two umbrellas for her and a perfume for this lady. Smart! Cool! Oh, I need to get a coffee. Okay, and two necklaces. you. Cool. Let's put this on one of the table. Ah, oh, actually, I saw and heard the cool. mouse there. Oh, I need to get her the coffee before she falls asleep. Time, so I'll restock the shelves. More coffee. He's going to be going through a lot of coffee today, apparently. Smart. Another restocking over there. Trying on their earrings and necklaces. Stunning. and you want some makeup. Smart! And it looks like the final coffee of the day because I'm about at the end of the day here. Cool! Sharp! Cool. Okay, I didn't get the bonus for having a completely clean store at the end of the day. This is so exciting, Angela, with all of her friends. You're going to get picked, Angela, I just know it. Shh, let's not put too much pressure on her. You're, you better pick Angela if you know what's good for you, you diva. 
quiet everyone, Truly's on. And I'm pleased to reveal the, the women I have handpicked to be my replacement are... First, Laurie from New York, who adds a wonderful cosmopolitan touch. Bruna from Rio de Janeiro. Viola from Italy. Yuna from Japan. Celine from Paris, France. And last but not least... Oh, a cliffhanger. Fabulous. So... That was scenario 11, a nice three star, found the mouse, did the task, and it ends on a cliffhanger. We don't know if Angela gets to take part in the wonderful fashion show thing. That is, um, what's her name? Truly? It's the fashion designer who's picking her replacement. Well, on that happy note, that's where I'm going to end this episode. <laughs> with the joy of that, that would be Truly, the one with the silly glasses and the really stupid looking hair and the little rat faced dog not that I've made a judgement call based on her looks in any way shape or form much right that's why I'm going to end this episode as always I hope you enjoyed and hopefully I will see you down the road for more of Angela's fashion fever cheerio yeah.